Today is going to be so much fun. After a year of bowing to the cool kids, we finally get to kick back and relax. This is going to be great. Yeah, I can't wait for summer to start. I can finally stop eating my lunch out of the trash. Shut up, Joe. Maybe if you stop pissing your pants in class and simping for Hillary, the cool kids would stop taking your lunch money. Shut up, Donald. Today's the last day of school. We can forget about all of that and just have fun. Yeah, I heard some rumors that they are going to get a bouncy house this year. That is absolute cap. This school is in more debt than the United States. Ain't no way that they can afford a fucking bouncy house. Chill out, Donald. Here comes Ben. Oh, for fuck's sake, please, someone shoot me in the face. I would rather be blind than see his hideous face. Wow, would you look at that? The school seems to be in so much debt that they had to hire the most pathetic clowns that I have ever seen. Ooh, really? They hired clowns? This is going to be great. Ben, what the fuck do you want? Shouldn't you be busy moderating your Discord server? You're a little bitch, Donald. I just came here to shed my supreme social dominance on you fools. Enjoy it while it lasts. Today is field day. And since you're in high school, you don't get to be there to make our lives hell. Yeah, we get to be free from your tyranny today. Uh, uh, what a loser. Those losers have no right to laugh in my face like that. Oh, well, perhaps I will be there after all. Who the fuck is that? You better get the... Oh, hey there, Ben. How are you doing? I'm doing good, Mr. Principal. How are you? I'm doing all right, kid. I'm ready for this school year to be over. This summer, I'm going to take the kids to Afghanistan on vacation. Wow, that sounds like so much fun. Hey, I couldn't help but see that you were looking for field day chaperones. Perhaps I could be of assistance. Wow, Ben. I am most honored that you would pledge yourself to the cause. I think it would be great if you chaperoned field day. The kids could really look up to your stellar excellence. Would you like to work the snack station? Actually, I heard that Donald, Joe, and Obama are planning to cause trouble, so maybe I could watch over them. What? Those no-good assholes are planning to ruin my field day! God damn it! Okay, Ben, you have complete authority over them for the rest of the day. I want you to make sure that those cocksuckers don't step out of line. It would be my most gracious honor, sir. A few moments later... Wow, Joe, you weren't kidding. That's the best bouncy house I have ever seen. I can't wait to go play. Yeah, told you so. <laughs> yeah, that thing is huge, almost bigger than Ben's ego. Oh shit, speak of the devil. Oh, for fuck's sake, what is that piece of shit doing here? Listen up, boys. I know that you boys are planning on causing trouble today, so Ben here is going to be in charge of you for the entire day. What? Hey, that's not fair. We Shut the fuck up! You boys are not gonna ruin my field day. I will hear no arguments. You boys be good. You heard him, boys. I'm in charge of you bitches for the rest of the day. You shall bow to my every command and worship the ground I walk on. Oh, rats! Do not speak out of line. Ben, you are literally the biggest piece of horse shit that has ever walked on this earth. All right, that's it. Give me ten push-ups. Hell no, you're an asshole. I ain't doing shit. Hey, Principal, Donald isn't respecting my authority. Boys! Respect Ben's authority and do whatever he tells you. Otherwise, you will be spending the rest of next year in detention. You heard him, boys. A few moments later. All right, boys. Your master had Starbucks this morning, right after trying his first cigarette. So he has to take a fat dump. If it were appropriate, I would take it right in Donald's mouth. However, he isn't worthy of my excrement. I shall return shortly. Oh my god, this is the worst day ever. Ben somehow managed to take such a beautiful day and turn it into shit. Yeah, for real, this was supposed to be the best day of the year. I just want this day to end already. You know what? Screw this. Let's go jump on the bouncy house. Donald, we can't. We will get in so much trouble. Joe, this might be our only opportunity to have fun. Do you really not want to jump on the bouncy house that you were raving about this morning? You know, I think I'm with Donald on this one. We should try to have at least the tiniest scrap of fun. But what if Ben comes back and then tells Mr. Principal? Ben is taking a coffee cigarette dump. We definitely have time. A few moments later. Wow, this is so much fun. This is the biggest bouncy house I've ever been on. I've been on bigger. My mom took me to pump it up for my birthday last year. Meanwhile. Wow, that was insane. That was definitely one for the books. Hey, Ben! Since those suckers that you are watching over are known troublemakers, I've brought you some reinforcements. Ping has volunteered himself to help you with the boys. We will work hard to make sure that those boys don't get in trouble, sir. Great! That's what I like to hear. Report back to me if there are any issues. Ping, what are you doing? 
This was supposed to be my opportunity to be in charge. I heard that you had authority over those delinquents, and I just couldn't help but offer my hand in servitude. God damn it, fine, but just remember that I am top dog. My word is law. They shall listen to both of us now. We shall rule together in unity and make sure those troublemakers don't ruin field day. A few moments later. Wow, that was amazing. Yeah, but if Donald wasn't doing backflips, then we wouldn't have gotten kicked out. You're just jealous that you can't do a backflip. Did you see me? My technique was flawless. Yeah, yeah, whatever, Donald. Well, 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 what do we have here? Three bad boys that have stepped out of line. Who the fuck is that? I am Ping. I shall be overseeing Ben and you guys to protect Field Day at all costs. No, we are both ruling over you guys together. Wow, as if one uptight dictator wasn't enough. All right, that's it. 20 push-ups, all of you. Yeah, go run laps around the field. 20 push-ups first. Two laps around the field now, as your supreme ruler demands. Jesus fucking Christ. All right, one lap around that field, then do 20 push-ups, and then run another lap. This is the worst day ever. A few moments later. I'm so tired. Can we do something fun now? Fun? Fun is only meant for law-abiding citizens, not untrustworthy prisoners. Attention, everyone! The tug-of-war contest will be starting in five minutes. Get your shit together! Ooh, the tug-of-war contest. Can we join? No, there will be no fun for the no-good prisoners. Yeah, whatever. You guys are just scared to face us. You guys are weak rulers and are afraid to show us who's on top. Hmm, yeah, I think Donald is right. How can we respect our rulers if they aren't even stronger than us? Are you seriously entertaining the idea that we would lose to you? You butt wipes wouldn't stand a chance. Yeah? Prove it then. I bet we would mop the floor with you. Oh, jeez. I don't know about this, guys. Shut up, Joe. All right. If you wish to taste defeat, then you shall have it. We will destroy you. Yeah. You pussies don't stand a chance at defeating your mighty rulers. A few moments later. All right, boys. This is our chance. We can embarrass them in front of the whole school. Are we sure about this, Donald? Yeah. If we lose, then we will never hear the end of it. Boys, this is our opportunity. We will come back champions next year if we win. Okay, let's do this. Let's beat those suckers. All right, hands in. Go, go, team. go team. I can't believe those losers actually think they can beat us. We will prove ourselves above them. But who do we get for our third teammate? So, I hear you guys are going to teach those no-good assholes a lesson in class. I will be your third teammate. Excellent. Our perfect victory shall be remembered for years to come. A few moments later... All right, everyone! I want a fair contest! Once the rope reaches over the line, that team wins. If you cross the line, you are out. I will be joining the high schoolers so that it's an even matchup. Oh, what? No way. They have the principal on their team. This is so unfair. He is literally a grown-up. Whatever. It's too late to back down. We can win this. Begin! Muscles aren't built for this like they used to be. I expect you guys to do something about it. Perhaps we can take out one of their teammates. Yeah, let's do that. Let's make Joe cry. Joe, you're a little bitch. You suck ass, Joe. You aren't strong enough for this. My grandmother is stronger than you, and she's dead. Come on, Joe. Ignore them. We are losing advantage. Hurry. I can feel my back giving out. Find a way to completely crush his morale. Hey, Joe. Hillary told me that she thinks you're ugly and that you are a loser. And also, I was her first kiss. Joe, you literally pissed yourself in front of everyone last year. Fuck you, Joe. Go fuck yourself, Joe. The beta loser finally summons the courage to deliver a comeback. What a surprise. Fuck you, Ben. You are a complete waste of life. You shall now taste defeat by those you consider beneath you. Yeah, let's Whoa, go, Joe. That was amazing. Oh my god, yes. what just happened? Yes! Three hours later. You boys need to learn the meaning of being a good sport. My vacation to Afghanistan has been cancelled due to my current conditions. Therefore, we will be spending a lot of time together this summer. I shall be seeing you boys in summer school. How come every time something good happens, it turns to shit? <laughs> <laughs>